Ever wondered what are the worst places to live in the UK? Today we're exploring five cities that have earned that dubious honour. From the foggy shores of Blackpool to the industrial landscapes of Scunthorpe, these cities have more in common than you might think. High crime rates, staggering levels of poverty, and some rather infamous criminal cases have made them notorious. But it's not all doom and gloom, these cities also have their unique charms and quirks. So buckle up as we begin our journey through the UK's worst places to live. First on our list is the seaside resort town of Blackpool, home to approximately 140,000 residents. Despite its charming Victorian architecture and iconic Blackpool Tower, it's suffering from a high crime rate. Violent offences are alarmingly common, and it's no stranger to the headlines for all the wrong reasons. Poverty is another issue here, with an unemployment rate of 4.7% outstripping the national average and limited job opportunities adding to the struggle. As for notorious crimes, the infamous Blackpool Poisoner case of the late 80s continues to cast a shadow over the town. While the Blackpool Tower might be a sight to see, the town's issues are certainly not. Next, we're journeying to Hull, a city home to approximately 260,000 people, all too familiar with an infamous reputation. Hull grapples with a high crime rate, with a particular emphasis on drug-related offences. Poverty is another pressing issue, with limited opportunities contributing to a cycle of deprivation, which is starkly reflected in the city's high unemployment rate of around 8%. Notorious criminal cases, including the notorious Hull arson attack of 2007, have only added to this city's notoriety. Despite its issues, Hull held the title of the UK City of Culture in 2017. Yet, the city's challenges extend far beyond the cultural sphere. Our next stop is Scunthorpe, a town that's seen better days. With a population of about 82,334 people, it was once a booming hub of steel production. However, today it's more renowned for its high crime rates and dwindling job prospects. An astounding 11% unemployment rate hangs over the town, a stark evidence of the dwindling job prospects. Residents bear the brunt of the economic downturn, with poverty a stark reality for many. Infamous criminal cases like the Scunthorpe heist further tarnish the town's reputation. Despite its rich industrial past, Scunthorpe struggles to shake off its present woes. Scunthorpe might be known for its steel production, but with these figures it's not exactly a town of steel. We finally reach our destination, Peterborough, a city with a population of approximately 202,110 people and a place notorious for its less than stellar reputation. Known for its high crime rates, Peterborough, where around 4.5% of its residents are unemployed, has become infamous for theft and burglary. Poverty is widespread, with a significant number of individuals struggling to make ends due to a lack of opportunities. It's impossible to forget the notorious case of the Peterborough Ditch Murders, a crime that shook the nation. Despite its status as a cathedral city, housing a population of over 200,000, the issues plaguing Peterborough are far from divine. Peterborough may be a cathedral city, but with its high crime rates and unemployment figures, it's far from heavenly. So there you have it. Five of the worst places to live in the UK. From Blackpool's staggering crime rates, Hull's infamous reputation for poverty, Scunthorpe's dismal living conditions, to Peterborough's notorious criminal cases, the reasons are as diverse as they are troubling. These cities serve as a stark reminder of the challenges some residents face daily. Remember, every city has its issues, but these five take the crown. Stay safe out there and thanks for joining us on this journey.